Zoe Saldana. She wants a role in DC. She wants to work with James Gunn again in the DC universe. Uh, Batman. Batman. <laughs> <laughs> Next topic. <laughs> no. <laughs> just, just imagine. <laughs> Um, you, need to, you need to put that. You need to put that. You need to put that as a shot. It yeah. um, was like uh, new DC, new DCU Batman, and then just question mark it. It's not really. It's, it's just. It's just a joke at the end of the day. It's not like. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think it'd be funny. <laughs> it's like so. He's Dana. She wants to be in the DC universe. <laughs> Batman. <laughs> What character could you see her playing in the DC universe? <clears throat> Alfred. <laughs> Seriously, this really DC knowledge comes out of it, Kyle. Now, she can't be Hot Girl because we've already got a Hot Girl cast in the DC universe. Um, um, mm, that's a good question. I. I think, to be honest, it'd be great to see her as a... Hmm. She could be Batwoman, is it? Yeah. Batgirl or Batwoman? Yeah. I think that'd be a great pick, because I don't feel like the role has been done well in previous. I've not watched the shows. I don't want to watch the shows uh, of, of the Batwoman or Batgirl show. I'm not too sure. And but it's it's annoying because that character is really good. I've heard in the comics, and I only know a little bit of the character from the Arkham games, and she's fucking great in that. You know, Oracle before she was, uh, you know, shot by the Joker, crippleized. Like, yeah, she she had a great little um, DLC mission, and it was just fun to play as the character. Like I, I enjoyed I enjoyed her as a character, and I mean they're already doing the Bat Family. You know, by the looks of it, they've already got Dam- they want to do Damian Wayne, Batman's son. Well, they did Batman say more, mem- more members of the Bat family will be in that. Well, yeah, so I, I think that would be a great pick if we have, you know, uh, a Batgirl or Batwoman, which, which, whichever, I don't know which one it is, but, it, you know, I think that would be a great pick. Jim, uh, Jim Gordon's daughter. Yeah, no, definitely. Uh, and this is time for Callum's pisses everyone off answer. One. She'd make a great Wonder Woman. She really would. Only thing going against her for Wonder Woman is she might not look it. This woman is 45 years old and she looks mm. fantastic. They might want to go with someone a bit younger. I think she I think she'd be a great Wonder Woman. Now, I I that was some that was a, that, you know, I was going to say that, but I just kind of like the idea of obviously they're doing the Bat family, so yeah, and it might, you know it might be a bit too similar to what she did in Guardians. You know, sword wielding. You know, this time she don't have to get painted up in makeup. But just uh, just picture this for a second, Kyle. Zoe Saldana becomes Wonder Woman in the DC universe. She then is in a Justice League movie. Let's say this James Gunn Justice League movie or James Gunn produced Justice League movie, is fantastic. Everyone's on board with DC. Everyone loves it. It hits two billion. Zoe Saldana, again, would be <laughs> box office gold. Because <laughs> she's got Infinity War, Endgame, Avatar, Avatar. She needs to get a DC film up there. I'm sure she will. Yeah, maybe. I'm sure she will. But no, I'm just thinking of like other options to say, like, uh, Zatanna, um, which might 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 be a good option as well. There's loads of like small DC characters. Uh, Catwoman, maybe. Obviously, we've already got Zoe Kravitz as Catwoman in the the Batman universe, and people might s- start picking similarities between that. Um, but yeah, no, these these loads of great options and Mister Freeze's wife. Yeah, Mr. Freeze's wife. Or Mr. Freeze. We're in 2024. That can happen. Yep. Zoe Saldana, Mr. Freeze confirmed. 
Also a player, I think. Yeah, also a player. Oh, she could be the Flash. Jack Black and Superman. Yeah, Cyborg. She's done... James himself. James, she could be playing James Gunn. Like, who wouldn't want to play James Gunn? James Gunn actually played himself in the Harley Quinn show. That's, oh, an, yeah. that's another. Um, not Harley Quinn. Poison Ivy. Ooh. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Yeah. I, 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 I like that a lot. Yeah. And, you know, hopefully they can get it right and get her in a skimpy outfit or something like that. Um, sorry, Kyle. I've let us down again. We're a mature channel. No, we're not. Um, we, we're really not. <clears throat> See it. Yeah. Who knows? Wonder it's, Woman, Poison know. Ivy, Batgirl, Kyle was saying, uh, or, or Batman. Who knows? Anyway. My money's on, my money's on uh, Jim Gordon himself. <clears throat> Ooh. Yeah, I like it. Jamila Gordon. No, just good old Jim Gordon. Just good old Jim Gordon. Mustache and everything. Mustache and everything. Big long brown trench coat. Still kind of hot. I was like, proper like, just a very like, you know, if you look at him, you can tell he smells. <laughs> Like, come and cancel tax. You wanted to throw that in there? I just love saying, come and cancel tax. Right, anyway. <laughs> <laughs>